B-52s with their sophisticated radars are able to strike in any weather, each carrying more than 30 tons of bombs, blast enemy bunkers and supply dumps, devastating the surrounding landscape. night, unseen and unheard, until their payloads hit, they strike terror into the hearts of the communists. In 1969, newly elected President Nixon launched secret B-52 bombing raids over Cambodia against North Vietnamese and Viet Cong sanctuaries, driving them further into the country. Nixon neither informed Sihanouk nor sought his approval for this escalation. Targets. The extent of Nixon's secret bombing was not uncovered by Congress until July 1973, four years after it had started. Nixon had waged war in Cambodia without congressional approval. It prompted angry congressional reaction and led to the first call for Nixon's impeachment. From the start of the war, B-52s hammered airfields and large strategic targets such as power plants, petroleum supplies, and military centers. But their most important mission hit the Republican Guard. Very early on into the campaign, we were providing three B-52s every hour and a half over a Republican Guard target or a target that had to do with softening up the Kuwaiti theater of operations. Secondly, we struck all day and all night without warning, without their ability to effectively mass a counter-air offensive against the B-52s. And as such, it was... 